<coughs> Wash my hat and brims all jacked up. It's the right brother, baby. You miss me? I know you did. You ain't even got to tell me. I know you did. You ain't even got to tell me. All right, let me get in the camera so y'all can see me. Um, all right, first question. Why is my beard so shiny? I use coconut oil in my beard. Uh, I usually put that on every day. Uh, I wash my beard every day. I actually trimmed it, so it's kind of looking a little. I I got some the the biggest edger I got, and just rent it because I wanted to grow evenly. So I did that, and I don't know how it's gonna come out, but I don't have no comb to comb the B to bees because it's back to B to bees since the long strands and uh been clipped off, but it'll get back right. Um, what else is going on with me? I haven't did a video in a while. Here's the reason why. I've been consumed with a, I'm doing the next step in my plan. So my next step is to go uh, lease purchase. All right. So because I want to go lease purchase, you know, everybody. <coughs> everybody know that I want to go to Snyder, excuse me. Um, well, here's the thing. I'm not going to Snyder. I'm going to a different company for my lease purchase. I really didn't want to give you all the information just yet because it's not in stone, but Fuck it, here it is. Uh, the company I'm going to, drum roll please. Interstate. Interstate distribution. So here, here, here's the story. Uh, I uh, uh, lost my whole train of thought. Okay, so I wanted to go with Schneider. Got all the information. There was a few things I needed to do, like take my taker's endorsement, uh, set up my LLC before I go to Schneider, and do this and do that, uh, which is all fine and dandy because, I mean, technically once I get over there and get onto the choice board, I'm going to be running as a lease purchase, but I'm going to have my own business, you know? So, um, Brian with the T, shout out to him. He know who he is. Told me there's another company that's doing something like the choice board, but um, it's a new program. So I called the I called Interstate. It was Interstate. I called Interstate and was like, "Hey, um, I would like to check y'all out. I would like to get on the board." And I tried to do a lot of research on it, but there's no information. So the board over there, instead of calling it choice board, it's called the Freedom Board. You still be able to pick your own loads. Uh, dispatch yourself. You're still doing a lease purchase. Um, it's a newer program. It just started out in October. So um, here's the catch to doing it. Before you go over there and do the Freedom Board, they want you to do a what's, uh, what's called a rental program. The rental program is basically saying you're going to rent a truck from Interstate. You're going to rent a truck from Interstate and you're going to run for them. I swear I don't know if y'all yeah, can see me or not. Let me see in the window. I can't. I can't really see the reflection. Uh, you're basically going to run for them. You, um, the program is a max of 90 days. You can do it for 30 days and go to lease purchase. You can do it for 60 days, go to lease purchase, or you can do it for 90 days. The good thing about that is, is what it's doing is giving you practice because it's absolutely walk away. I don't know how to lease purchase if it's walk away, but this is totally walk away. You get all your money and everything that you you put in. Uh, you've made, but it's. Um, just a test run for you to see if you are able to do lease purchase. You know, the bad part about it is you're still getting dispatch. You're getting a dollar and one cents a mile plus 100% of your fuel surcharge. So whatever the fuel surcharge is, uh, you're getting 100% of that. Now, I know I'm going to get a lot of people. Like, I would never run for a dollar and one cents plus 100% fuel charge. It's not about that. It's about getting the experience. All right. Now, the reason to... The truck note over there for the rental program is three hundred and fifty dollars a week. Compared to Snyder was eight to nine hundred dollars a week. Just truck note, just truck note over at Snyder was going it'll run you between seven and nine hundred dollars a week. Over here is three hundred fifty dollars a week. Um, you will get um, one hundred percent of your fuel surcharge. Um, it'll give me. A, the it'll let me dip my toe in to this lease purchase game it'll also help me get the money that i need in order to start my llc get the needed things that i need like i mean i was looking at the randy mac the Rand mcnally gps and that's just like five six hundred bucks for the ones that I, the ones that i wanted it was like 4.99 and up 
You know, it also uh, gives me experience running my own truck. Uh, the other bad thing is those trucks are governed because it's technically a rental truck. The lease trucks are not governed, but those trucks are governed at like 62, 63 miles an hour, which technically I'm already used to running because that's what I run as a company driver. Um, but you can do that and they also have percentage pay. So after you do X amount of days or 30 days, let's say 30 days on the mileage pay, you can switch over to percentage pay. When you switch over to percentage pay, you get you start getting paid percentage. But by then, um, once you switch over to percentage, you they should have enough confidence in you, and you should have enough confidence in yourself to be able to run the Freedom Board or like Snyder's Choice Board. Then you jump on the Snyder's Choice Board, you jump into a lease purchase, doing the rental. Um, they'll take X amount of cents to uh, help with your escrow. Uh, they'll take um, a little something to help with your down payment for your lease purchase truck. So let's say if you it's five hundred bucks a month. So let's say if you did uh, uh, three months, that's five hundred dollars a month, fifteen hundred dollars. You can put that fifteen hundred dollars down, or you can put that fifteen hundred dollars into uh, your escrow. Uh, so it's a great way to kind of get into the lease part of things without actually getting into it and a complete walk away. And once I see that I can handle that, then I can go ahead and dump, jump on that choice board. Now the scary part about it is because. With the Snyder, I've seen people's pay. You know, I've seen their actual checks a week. I've seen the freight that they have uh, in California. Uh, one of the things the guy was saying, I could run the I-5 corridor. Basically, that's running from uh, California, Oregon, Washington, and make pretty good money, which I find is pretty dope. Um, so that's definitely the route that I'm taking. And the reason why I ain't really been doing videos because with this, I'm so consumed with the unknown that it's it it is stopping me from focusing on a variety of content. <laughs> um, it's stopping me from focusing on making content because every day that I'm up, I'm thinking about the that next step I'm going to take. Now I'm going to fire off and take that step February 4th if everything goes good. So I'm waiting for the phone call tomorrow or wait, what time is it? Today. I'm waiting on that phone call today to see if um, I'm good to go. If I'm good to go, uh, then yeah, February 4th, I would definitely start uh, doing that. Um, once you do the lease purchase program, you're going to be on percentage pay as well. And uh, yeah, you get to pick your own loads, go where you want, do what you want. Trucks not governed, you run everything. You're running everything. Uh, so I think that's pretty dope. That's the move that I'm gonna make. Um, and uh, that's how things are gonna go. Uh, because I'm waiting on this phone call today, I think that's why I'm, I'm feeling comfortable with, with making some videos. I gotta, I'm gotta. i gonna make probably two more videos after this. Uh, but. That's my next step. So y'all basically seen me go from school. I don't know if I did a video in school. Y'all see me go OTR. After OTR, you guys see me go like a local dedicated where I'm home every weekend. Then you guys see me go from local dedicated to um, uh, home every weekend doing this route that I'm on now with this day cab. And now y'all about to see me take another step into uh, a rental. Then y'all gonna see me take another step into a lease purchase and choice board. So you guys are there for, along for the ride. I will give all the information that I can get, <coughs> comprehend, and feel comfortable giving to you, uh, giving it to you. Uh, and yeah, that's basically what's going on with me. So stay tuned. I got a few things in the works, man. A few things in the works. If I get that phone call tomorrow and they say it's all good, I'm gonna give Swift my two weeks notice, and I'm gonna still run properly for them for two weeks. Um, and then I'm heading to. I want to say they got a yard in Fontana, but yeah, the company I'm going to is. I'm planning on going to, let me not say going to, I'm planning on going to interstate distribution. So the, the, the cucumbers, you know, the big green, you know, it was either going to be green or orange, either way. Um, that's my next step. And that's what I'm going to do to uh, further my career in this truck driving thing. I don't know. I just spit it all on y'all. <laughs> so, There you have it. Um, 
There, again, if you try to search for information for the Freedom Board, I really couldn't find anything. I couldn't find any groups. The Freedom Board started out in October 1st is when they released the Freedom Board for their drivers. So, Not only am I going in with no information, at least with the Snyder thing, I had some information. Now I'm going in with no information. Um, and I'm just going, just, I'm just going, uh, so if you're religious, pray for me. If you're not, throw the karma out there for me, you know, let's see what we do. Let's see what we get, man. And yes, I will show my check once uh, I start doing my little lease, my little rental joint, see how that works out. You know, of course my check ain't going to be big like some of y'all, you know, $58,000 a week type motherfuckers, but uh, it is what it is. So I give you what I got. And if you don't like it, hey, it's more than what some people are making. <laughs> uh, if I completely fail, <coughs> you guys will see that as well. In which case, I would just go back to a company, drive for a company until I get my money back up and then go back out and go with my original plan. You know, I am kind of deviating from the plan a little bit by going to interstate. Um, and hopefully everything works out. Uh, I'm pretty confident that it will. But uh, again, there's that that 10 percent of uncertainty that it will not. Uh, again, if it doesn't, shit happens. You guys will see w uh, where I went wrong and where I failed. And hopefully you'll learn from that situation. If I succeed, you guys will see what I did to succeed and to become prosperous and provide for my family. You know, so for you guys, it's going to be a win-win regardless. Um, regardless. So let me go ahead and make these other videos. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and upload this. It's the right brother look. Like my shit. Per Woody, the likes is what gets you up there. So like, subscribe, share if you need, if you feel like it. Uh, but definitely like and subscribe. All right. Definitely looking for that. Um, Trucker Brown just hit that 4K. I think I just hit 3,400 on mine. So I would definitely like to see that grow. And, uh, and just enjoy my journey, man. Come on. Come on. You know what? I wish I can point like Mark State or whatever his name is uh, that drive for Prime. He points real good at the camera. He's like, come on. Yeah, come with me. I was like, hey, don't be, hey, don't be pointing at me. <laughs> anyway, all right. It's the right brother. I'll holler at you. Peace.